Hello and welcome to this ETZ video for purchase order entry. Within this video I'll be going through the process of adding the PO numbers to the system and where you can connect these to. Purchase orders are entered in the reference data menu and purchase order entry. Firstly, you will see a list of the PO numbers you already have added to the system. You can also search for PO numbers via the search option at the top. To add a new purchase order number, you click the New button located here at the bottom of the page. Firstly, you select the client the purchase order relates to from the list and enter the details along with a value if appropriate. To update an assignment with a purchase order or add a PO to a new assignment, you will need to go to the assignment entry area and select the assignment from the list. Or add the PO number during adding an assignment to the system. You can then attach the PO to the assignment via the main details section. For more information on this, please watch our video and read our KB on assignment entry and main details. There is also a purchase order report available in the reports menu which you will need to include as part of your process. To go to this report we need to go to the reports menu And then we click on sales reports and you will see the purchase order report. This report is useful in managing purchase orders and will highlight any POs that are running low or have overspent. I will show you the report. This report is very important if using the PO number functionality as the system will not monitor these for you and let you know when running out of funds. So please make sure the report is used frequently if you're using the PO functionality. Thank you for watching this ETZ video. For additional help on the system, please contact support. For more information, please see our knowledge base.